Hello, friends. Hello, friends. Hello, friends. It's time to say hello. Hello, friends. It's so good to see you again. It's Mrs. Foose. And we just had a kind of a special day not too long ago, and it was called Earth Day. Well, the Earth is where we live. And on Earth Day, we think a lot about how can we take good care of our Earth? We have to take good care of a lot of things. You might take good care of your room or your parents take good care of your house or your yard, but really everybody has to work hard to take good care of our earth to keep it nice for us and for all time. So um, I know I, Little Mouse was pretty excited about the idea of Earth Day, so I'm gonna see if he wants to come out and talk to you a little bit. Um, little Mouse, where are you? Little Mouse, where are you? Oh my goodness, <laughs> I finally found him, but my goodness, oh, can I help you, Little Mouse? Oh, what? Those things look too big for you to carry, Little Mouse. Oh, look at. Boys and girls, do you know what these are? They're toilet tubes. I think Little Mouse forgot to throw them in the trash bin. Well, Little Mouse, are you saying yes or no? That looks like a no. Well, Little Mouse, why wouldn't you want me to put these in the trash bin? The house will look much nicer and your room will look nicer if you don't have it full of old toilet tubes. Oh, boys and girls, he said it's not trash. He has plans for these toilet tubes. Let me show you what he just whispered to me. He thought he might make binoculars out of them. Oh, little mouse, that's a great idea. I guess they aren't trash, they're binoculars. Or I have another idea. Could they be a telescope? What do you think, little mouse? There, now he's looking at you. I never thought of that. Toilet tubes aren't trash. You can do a lot of things with them. You can paint them, you can make them into binoculars. I bet you boys and girls can even think of some cool things you could do with toilet tubes and some art supplies. All right, little mouse, have fun. <laughs> Can, you, you got him, you're gonna, ah! I knew you were gonna drop him, little mouse. Okay, fine, he's he's gonna say goodbye and he's gonna go work with his, his toilet tubes. Maybe the next time you see us, he'll have a pair of binoculars to show you. <laughs> okay, little mouse, I will see you later. But I guess, since he's kind of reminding Mrs. Foose, that things aren't always trash and it's better for our earth and something you maybe learned on earth day it's better to use things again in some way than always throw things in the trash we can recycle things we can reuse them and i have a book for you that i think you'll enjoy it's called hey whoa it's opening up Hey, that's not trash. And in this book, we'll find that this little boy is going to teach his mom what we can do with things instead of throwing them right in the trash. Now, we had already said you could reuse them, make them, use them as something else, like make toilet tubes into binoculars, but you can also recycle them. Some things can be crushed up, but then made into something entirely new in a factory or something like that. So let's see how this little boy teaches us how we maybe can not put things in the trash, but find a better place for them where they can get used again in some way. So here we go with the book, Hey, That's Not Trash. And 
if you look at the bottom, there's three slots and where I'm gonna be using these as I read the book. And one slot says paper. So if something is made out of paper, but it's not trash, we wanna recycle it, we'll put it in the paper bin. The middle bin is called the plastic bin. And the last bin is called the metal bin. And once you see how these bins work, you might wanna do something like that at home. So here we go with, hey, that's not trash. And here's the little boy. I hope you can see him good. And it says, it's time for breakfast. I love my cereal, but it looks like I finished the milk. So boys and girls, here's the milk jug. Mom takes the empty milk container and puts it in the trash. Hey, Mom, that's not trash, he says. It can be recycled. We should put it in a separate bin with other things that are made out of plastic. So let's go ahead and put the milk jug in the plastic bin. Today in school, we are making collages out of things we brought from home. I'm making mine out of an egg carton, scraps of fabric, and an old magazines. Everyone uses newspaper to protect his or her desk from glue. Oh, look at, they're using all sorts of things that are not trash. Hang on, everyone. Clean newspaper should not go in the trash. We can put it in a recycling bin for things made out of what, what are, what are newspapers made out of? Paper. So there goes the newspapers into the paper bin and then we can use it for things like covering our tables. Time to play. Whee! I spot some empty soda cans at the bottom of the slide. Do you see them right here? There they are. Someone littered. Boo! It's important to keep our earth clean, and that includes our playground. I'm going to put these cans in the recycling bin for things made out of metal. There we go. Mom bought me new soccer cleats. Yahoo! Now that I don't need the shoe box anymore, I can recycle it. So he's not gonna throw it in the trash, is he? So here's the shoe box. If he's gonna recycle the shoe box, boys and girls, would it go in paper, plastic, or metal? Well, I think I heard paper because it's like cardboard paper. So there it goes in that bin. My new soccer cleats help me score a goal. What a game! We each get a water bottle and I'm so thirsty that I drink my entire bottle of water. The coach puts the empty bottle in the trash. Oops. What do you think about that? Hey, coach, that's not trash. This can be recycled. I can show you which bin it goes in. So what do you think, a water bottle? Is it made out of paper, plastic, or metal? I think I heard plastic. That's right. So it's in the plastic bin. I get home from the soccer game. Dad has made me a big bowl of soup. Yum. Thanks for the soup, Dad. I say, did you know that this soup can can be recycled? We can put it in a recycling bin for metal. Let's drop it in. It goes in a recycling bin, but it's on its right path to becoming something 
else. Thanks for helping me keep lots of things out of the trash. Taking care of the planet is the cool thing to do and recycling is fun. All the things we put in the recycling bins will be turned into new things that we can use again. So, when you look in the garbage can, don't be afraid to say, hey, that's not trash. And that's the end of the story, boys and girls. It's almost time to go, but I feel like little mouse. Okay. I think he has just painted his, his, um, toilet tubes and they're drying so he wanted to come and say goodbye oh instead of saying goodbye do you know what he wants to say and he wants you to say it with him he wants you to say hey that's not trash but don't whisper it say it kind of loud because we want to make sure people don't just throw away trash if it could be used again are you ready little mouse one two three Hey, that's not trash. <laughs> oh, that was good, little mouse. So, boys and girls, I hope you had fun hearing the book, Hey, That's Not Trash. And I hope maybe you can think of some ways to recycle trash or to use things again to help keep our earth beautiful and clean, like we talked about for Earth Day. So, goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. It's time to say goodbye. See you next time.